Hi, Brian from GuitarHelper.net. Um, I want to show you something that I wish was so shown to me earlier when I was growing up and learning. Um, a different way to look at the fingerboard, how, how things connect diagonally by octaves. So if I have a G note, those are my octaves. So if I have a pattern, let's start on the basic, on the bottom two strings, on the sixth and fifth string. If I have a, a pattern on, on those two strings, it kind of diagonally goes across the fingerboard using those octaves. So to keep it simple, if I play one, three, one, three, right? So the, the pattern is symmetrical across the fingerboard. One, three, one, three, one, three, one, three. It's always one, three. Go up two frets. Got to go up three frets from the B for the B string. But if you if you're strong on your octaves, it works out pretty well. Um, you can do it with arpeggios, just triads. You get more mileage out of out of doing something like this and, instead of just playing three notes. Like I ended up playing nine notes on on the same harmony. Um, you can apply it to, so that's a triad. It works really well with seventh arpeggios. So if I have <clears throat> A minor seven, so I have one four. Uh, D minor seven is one four, one four here. So that's minor from the fifth string, first finger. Um, so it really works well. A major seven arpeggio. Um, it also works again if you have any pattern on those two strings, either the first, the first two, the middle two, or the bottom two strings. You can you can work it out across the fingerboard. Uh, pentatonics would be a five note pattern, so you're going to be sliding on one string. So if I have A minor, let's start it from the G note. So that's a sl so if it's that's the pattern one three one three slide one three one three slide one three one and actually those kind of kind of less jumping around kind of connects kind of smoothly on that um, if I did pentatonic so let's say if I do a Started from the root A minor, one four one slide four. So that's the pattern. So again, any type of pattern on the bottom two strings or any two sets of strings you can apply going across the fingerboard and get more mileage out of it. So any questions, let me know. Brian at guitarhelper.net.